Hey guys, it's Sam. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. For today's video, I'm trying out a new face mask and today I'm trying out the new Origins Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask to Clear Pores. Before we get started, please don't forget to subscribe in the little button down there and give this video a thumbs up. It really helps me out and helps my channel. And if you want to know my thoughts about this mask, then just keep on watching. Now, I haven't been wearing makeup a lot during this quarantine. Actually, I haven't worn makeup in about two weeks. Um, but I'm gonna, I because I had pre-filmed videos, so I actually have to start recording because I am almost done with those like pre-filmed videos. So I decided to just do a mask before actually putting on some makeup. I'm planning to film one or two more videos after this. And so I wanted to have a little bit more of a cleaner skin. I already uh, took a shower and I cleaned my face with my, um, I always forget the name, my little brush, my Clarisonic, no, that's the one that I used to have. Foreo, the Foreo little thingy to clean my face. So my face is completely clean. The key ingredient here is charcoal. It is recommended for normal oily or combination skin. And the benefit is detox and purify. It, on the actual Origins website, it is $26. I bought mine off of Ulta and it was the same price. It is good to know 100% vegetarian and vegan, free from animal derived ingredients. What it is. It is a purifying charcoal mask on clogs pores for a perfectly perfectly pure look. It deeply de uh, detoxes, absorbs environmental toxins, and dissolves impurities. What it does, it is formulated with bamboo, char bamboo charcoal, and white china clay. It acts like a magnet to deep clean and dry out deep dwelling pore cloggers, impurities, and debriefs. And debris. Debrief. <laughs> Not debriefs. Um, it is formulated without parabens. Phthalates, sodium, blah, 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 sulfate. Okay, I'm gonna zoom you guys in a bit just because I want you guys to see kind of like my skin. Actually, my skin has been doing really, really well. I think that not wearing a lot of makeup has really like improved my skin. Um, my like time of the month just passed, so that's why this like imperfection right here, it's already like, it's just a scar as of right now. Um, but as you guys can see, I still have my redness as always. Um, but I actually do see a difference. Um, it actually has been helping a lot using my Foreo. I have definitely noticed a difference in my kind of like imperfections that I get. For this mask, you can use it once a week or as needed. So using a warm towel, you're going to put it on your face just to open up your pores and then you can go ahead and layer on the mask. So I'm going to go ahead and grab a warm towel and then I'll be right back. And we're just going to... We're just gonna rest this on our face so that we can open up the pores. Now that my pores are open, I'm gonna go ahead and start layering this mask on. And I have my trusty Real Techniques, um, the pointed foundation brush. This is the brush that I always use to apply all of my masks. I noticed that whenever I use masks, um, my, like it starts like burning a little bit. And this is like any mask that I've tried. So I'm going to let this dry and we're going to go ahead and rinse it off and come back to see the results. Right now it is completely dry and it feels really, really tight and it actually, yeah, it's already dried. It's like cracking already and um, I'm going to go and wash this off with warm water, just massaging this while I take it off. Like right here, it's already like coming off. So I'll be right back and we're gonna go ahead and see how my face looks and feels. I'm back and while I was like removing the mask, my skin was feeling so, so soft and I can see right away like a difference in how my pores look and kind of like the overall state of like my skin. I definitely see a difference on the redness right here. It is actually less red than um, before I put on the mask. I can, I mean, 
I don't have like a microscope like kind of like Robbie and Christy to like see my pores but I can tell that my skin is clean like it is extremely soft it feels so so like baby soft and like I can definitely see a difference on my pores and they definitely 100% look way smaller than before I mean I would definitely recommend this if you do have dry skin um, just have in mind that it will like um, dry down and it's gonna be like really drying like as you saw like the cracks so if you have sensitive or um, really dry skin just maybe try it um, on a little um, space on your face and see how your face kind of like reacts to it and just you know to be on the safe side I definitely see a difference on how my face and my skin looks and feels and I'm definitely gonna be incorporating that onto like my skincare routine and doing that once a week because like I said I do you know YouTube and I do wear makeup I feel like it definitely made a difference in my pores and yeah that is it for today's video I really hope you guys enjoyed if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe and the little button down there it really helps me out and it helps my channel if there are any other masks that you would like me to try out uh, please don't forget to leave them down in the comment section and until then I'll see you guys on my next one